right, so driveway tennis is a great way to play with your kids. And right now we're just using a jump rope. And this is Matthew and I'm Dawn, and we're just gonna demonstrate a few activities that you can do with your children in your driveway. So Matthew and I are gonna do some great things you can do with really, really young children to get them um, kind of tracking the ball and getting some spatial um, sense with their rackets and their bodies. So Matthew's gonna start out by rolling the ball. I'm gonna trap it with my racket and then I'm gonna roll it back. And the thing that you wanna remember is to get your child to turn their shoulders, turn their body, and hold their racket like this with the edge down, not like a golf club like this and roll it, but you want to edge down like this, rolling the ball back. So Matthew, you want to roll the ball, let me trap it. I'm going to roll it, trap it. I'm going to turn and I'm going to roll it back and I'm just going to scoot the racket along the ground. I'm going to trap it, I'm going to turn, and I'm going to run the racket like this. And you want them to go in a straight line because the pack of the racket path of the racket determines the path of the ball. So Matthew's going to take a racket and we're going to play a little game. So we're going to trap and um, roll the ball back and forth to each other and see how many times we can do that back and forth because kids like games with numbers. So Matthew, let's do that. Roll, trap, turn. That's one, trap, two, trap, three, trap, four, trap, five, trap. And they just go on and on. So that's a great game to do. All right, another thing that you can do with kids is a lobster trap. So you want to underhand toss to your kid. You want to underhand toss and you want it to bounce right in front of them and you want them to turn and you want them to trap the, trap the ball between their hand and the string. So Matthew, underhand toss. Let it bounce, turn, trap, and you want them to either roll the ball back with their palm up, either roll it back on the ground or underhand toss. And you want them to learn to underhand toss with both hands too. Very helpful in tennis. Do it again, turn, and I'm going to trap, okay? Second stage to this, second part of this progression, we're going to Go ahead. They're going to trap. They're going to drop it and bump it back. It's just a little bump back. Trap it, drop it, and bump it back. Okay? All right. Another little thing that they can do, you can do with them, they can let the ball fall, bump up, let it fall, and catch. Fall, bump up, fall, and catch. The next progression is with that is, Matthew, come over here. You can find a line in your pavement or something, and they can do little bump ups over this line. So we're just gonna do a little bump up. We're going back and forth, a little bump up. So here we go. Bump up, bump up, bump up, bump up, bump up. We're just taking turns bumping. Bump up, bump up, bump up. Okay, now we're ready to go across our homemade mat right here. So when they get that done, we can start playing tennis. We're going to bump up, bump up, bump up, bump up. And you want to keep it small to begin with. Bump up because you want this side turn and the racket out in front. Racket out in front, bump it up. Little bump. There we go, good. So just a little helpful hint for kids to get their grip, lay the racket down on the ground, take their hand, place it on the back of the racket, pick it up. They've got an Eastern grip and that's what we want kids to learn is hitting a forehand with an Eastern grip. When they go to hit a backhand, we just want them to turn, put their um, non-dominant hand on top and they're just gonna make a little loop and swing through. Forehand, they're going to turn, make a little C loop, and swing through the ball. Um, eventually, you want them to get to the point where they can self feed, where they can feed in a ball. You want it 45 degrees out here, rack it back, 
Just let them drop it free fall from their hand, swing through, and start a feed. Okay? Just some things to do with your kids. Hope this helps.